welcome back to Looks at Books. Today we are going to see the latest installment in Tolkien's Deluxe Editions. This is Beowulf, a translation and commentary by Tolkien and comes in this nice purple color. Not usual, but we haven't seen it before. Again inside this grayish tone, fairly thick book this time. Here you have the dragon. Let me zoom in on this. Let's see. Embroidered in gold as usual. Pages thick as usual, same quality as all the other editions. This inside is a dark brown and I never mentioned these, but all these books bring this sheet of paper, which has some information and some of them have the retail price. This one doesn't. It costs sixty pounds, I think. Yeah, it's at a talking a talking store. I didn't bought it for sixty pounds, obviously. Again, let me see this here. It's the marker this time. I don't think I ever mentioned the markers, but this one, it's sort of silverish. Doesn't matter. I'll probably cut that out. And number of pages. It's what four hundred four hundred and twenty-five, and then a couple of blank pages in the end for no specific reason. See, so you have the same dragon, which it's the name is there, but I, I won't dare to pronounce it. I haven't read this book. This is this is nice. I I, I I seldom ever read these books when I when I show them on the channel because I have so many things to read. I'm doing my PhD, and uh, as you may imagine, I'm not doing a PhD on Tolkien. So I, I don't have as, as much time as I would like neither to do the videos nor to read this book and the others. But here you have it, a quick look at Tolkien's Beowulf. This book was never finished. I think Tolkien for some reason dropped the translation and never got around to finish it. So it's edited uh, as usual by his son Christopher Tolkien. And it's another one for edition. Retail price sixty pounds, as I said, on Tolkien's official bookstore. You can get it on Amazon for less, but I don't advise anyone at all that does not reside in the United Kingdom to buy books on Amazon. They have ended a free super saver delivery. They were pretty assholes about it, if I may say so, because they ended it on April the 3rd and they sent the emails warning us on April the 4th. So I don't buy at Amazon anymore. I don't recommend them. Um, I bought this one at play.com from a merchant there. It cost me around 40 euros. So you can buy books cheaper somewhere else. Amazon is charging outrageous prices for for books these days some of sometimes if you pick one of those cheap paperbacks they will charge you more for the shipping costs that they do that they do for for the book itself so forget amazon there are plenty of options uh, around here you have it until next time mm -hmm.